Hi, on this video I'm going to show how we can query this layer that's bringing data every five minutes uh, with weather conditions. As you can see, this is the, the layer. So right now I'm going to do a spatial query uh, to grab this, 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 this station through the service page. So to do that, I will take the stations layer and then I'm going to use the query operation. So let me close this tab. I have already populated some fields in here. So here I'm saying, okay, I want to grab all features uh, that meet this condition, which is all of them, uh, one equal one, one, so true. And then I'm going to do a spatial uh, intersect. So I'm going to be sending a polygon in this case, which will represent one route and an area, which we normally call a buffer around that route. And with that, I'm going to say, please give me all the fields back. And then I will request the GeoJSON format. I'm going to be sending a post request. So how do I get this input geometry? Well, I have just publish a repo with a sample app which I have been which I have made sorry uh, based on the application that you can find on the spatial analysis chapter within the mapping APIs and location services guide so in here the geometry calculation so I have taken this application I have made this uh, small uh, fork, well, kind of fork, a uh, variation where I'm grabbing this geometry that's being calculated on the application. I'm going to use the geometry coming from here. So let's imagine I have a route that it's going through this path, and then I want to calculate the buffer. So I select the buffer operation, and then I just draw again. I, I could do this, of course, without drawing manually. I can send this operation. Uh, oh, it's out of that route with that buffer in particular, which is fixed to one mile, I think. So I'm going to draw again the route. Let's imagine I have this route. So I want to grab all the weather stations that are within the route that I am taking. So I'm going to take this geometry that uh, you can see here it's well it's pretty long. <laughs> so I'm going to paste the geometry in here and then I'm going to send the post request. So as you can see here I'm getting a coordinate that it's coming from Malaga which is uh, the city in here. And that's how it works. So just in case you want to explore this in more detail, I normally recommend to grab the post request from here, copy the current request, and then use Postman uh, to import this raw request, and then Use it from from here. So I hope this is helpful and help you to, to really understand how to do spatial queries on a feature service in RJS. Thank you.